Okay, so now we are up to soldering surface mount components on conductive fabric. Just as a reminder about our surface mount components, so here I have our LED and this is our resistor, our 220 ohm resistor. Surface mount components don't have leads, they have solder pads. So you can see this little strip of metal on either side of this LED and then the resistor has the same two pads on either side. So there are a couple of different ways we can do this. Like I mentioned in the thread video, we can either put a little bit of solder on the pad and then heat it up and let the, the conductive fabric sort of accept it. Or we can put some on, we can uh, lay down some solder on our conductive fabric and then heat it up and let uh, let the components sort of um, attach to it that way. So we'll try both options. We'll start with our resistor. And I'm gonna go ahead and start with the option of placing it on the um, conductive fabric. So I've got my soldering iron is heated up. I'm gonna clean it a little bit. And then I'm gonna go ahead and just apply a little tiny bit of solder here. Now you wanna be very careful. So I'm glad this happened. Um, my soldering iron might actually be a little bit too hot because I just pulled off a piece of my conductive fabric, which is not great. I'm gonna clean my soldering iron and I'm going to decrease my temperature. And instead of going back on to that one, I'm going to lightly, there we go, apply that to the other side of my conductive fabric. Uh, in this case, you know, the best scenario to do is probably to put some solder on the pads and heat it up that way especially if you think that perhaps you may have um, taken off a chunk and then the component won't fit in it anymore. I think we should be okay here. I'm gonna try this again. And here we go. This is a very delicate process, so you know, give yourself grace if it doesn't work the first time or two. I'm gonna put a little bit of solder on my tip and get those pads this time. Here we go. Let it cool. We should be good there. It's gonna be really important though to put fabric glue on that one. I'm gonna pick up a little bit of solder on my iron. Do the same thing over here. Perfect. Hold it, let it settle and cool, and we are good to go on that component. So we'll do the same thing. I'm just gonna go ahead and use the same technique on the other side, given the success we had with it on our resistor. So I'll just put a little tiny bit on my, there we go, on my soldering iron. Perfect. All right, now, like our through-hole LED, we know that our LED, our uh, surface mount LED has orientation, so we wanna make sure that we have uh, the negative side of our LED going to ground, which is right here, and I know that my little um, cutout triangle is there. So I'm gonna get a little bit of solder on my the tip of my soldering iron. I'm gonna lay it down and hold it tight. Okay, 